All right, guys. Hey, Glenn Murray here. Welcome to another Affiliate Profit Pages University uh, tutorial. This one's going to be how to basically connect AWeber autoresponder with ClickFunnels, especially for new accounts, because new accounts tend to have the problem that you can't do an API without having a double opt-in. And I'm going to show you can work around with that. I'm going to show you how to connect a really simple generic funnel. Uh, this is really good. I've used this for tens and probably a hundred thousand opt-ins through solo ads. A really good, simple landing page that you can use if you want it. I'll put it in the link below. If you're on my YouTube channel, make sure that you're hitting uh, subscribe. So basically, I'm just going to go through the steps and show you. It's really simple to do this. If you want more information, just, just message me. If you need a, a an, an email autoresponder sequence, I have a bunch of them. So you just need to message me for those. But really, I'm just going to go through the steps here. So basically, this is going to be our landing page. So what happens is someone goes here, they put their, their email in, they're going to be put it onto our email list, and then we're going to send them offers. So let's first off, let's go find an offer first. So this is Digistore24. You can do this with ClickBank. You can do it with Warrior Plus. You can do it with JVZoo, whatever you want. Whatever product you want to do. Now, now remember, you still have to create content to drive people to that to that page, or you can use solo ads. And in the Cheetah method, if you have the whole Cheetah method guide, I show you how to how to set it up and go do go uh, go order uh, solo ads. So if you don't have that, I'll put that in the links below as well. Uh, again, if you're in the university, of course, you have access to the whole Cheetah guide um, uh, program. Uh, all right, so let me get into this. So let me, I want to find something good. So I'm going to go into digital products. Um, and we want to go online marketing, e-business. And we want to find something that's got a nice big, okay, okay, so this hasn't, this hasn't a small 39 bucks, but look at this, this return rate is 38%. So you probably don't want to be promoting that. Just saying. This is one of my favorites, the passive income system 2.0 pays 495 bucks per. So those, that's the biggest one there is right now. There was some that were a thousand. You could do this with ClickBank. There's a couple that have a thousand dollar ones, but let's just do so. So passive income. So let's just say we're going to promote this one. Okay. So what we do is hit copy promote and I've got an affiliate link here. Now I'm going to go over to Aweber. If you don't have a free Aweber account, or actually you need the pro Aweber account. So basically your, your the thing is 20 bucks a month or something like that. Anyways, so what you do is you go down to sign up forms and you can create a sign up form for my website, not on a landing page because the landing page is what's going to be built in Aweber. So for my website, so basically what we need to do is we're going to get rid of all this extra stuff. So we're just going to go in here to this landing page. We're going to delete that. If you want to collect a name, you can, but I'm just going to delete it. So all I've got is the email. Tag is we're just going to go demo uh, tag. So demo tag is what you can make to trigger a campaign. So let's say you built a campaign in Aweber and you want to start, you can either start that campaign by when someone subscribes to that list, or you can say when, when a tag is added. So when, when someone opts in on this, this tag is added, that tag will trigger a campaign. All right. So we've, we've, we've got this stuff done. So we've got, so save form, we're going to go to the next step. So this is just a demo. So a thank you page, we want to send them to that, to that URL, right? So this is going to our Digistore. And now if they've already subscribed, you want them to, so let's say someone's already on your list and they come back and they see that, that opt-in page again, right? They don't get opted in again, but you can still, they're already on your list you can send them to that offer. So I put that in both of them. So there we go. We've got our, our affiliate offer there. So save your form. We go to step three and I will install my form, right? So we're going to go, we want the raw HTML version. Now we don't want any of the beautiful styles. All we want is the form. So see how it says from this tag. And if you don't know what, if you don't know what, what any HTML is just, Right here is where we're going to start. 
And here's where we're going to end. So if, to copy this, guys, you can just click on click on right at the beginning of it and scroll down. Hold your shift key and tap. Now it's going to highlight that. So this is our form. So this form has all the information we need to go over to ClickFunnels and put this in. So we're going to go copy and we're going to go over to here. So in settings, and guys, again, don't worry about building this. It's really easy to build, but I'll just give you this. So don't worry. You can just import this into your ClickFunnels account. So you want to go to integrations. Let's just remove this integration right now. So we want to go to uh, Aweber. Oh, no, sorry. We want HTML form. So you want to, if you don't have this, go into your settings and you want to set up an HTML form integration. It's really easy. Just go to settings, integrations, and it, there'll be like a button. You just click it and it's done. So we want to go HTML. So in, integrate an existing list and we want to paste it right there. Now we want to hit parse and now it says email not synced. We want to choose email, right? And then we want to save our form. So now we want to go back and we want to check our integration again, go back to it and make sure that it's saved correctly. So right there, this is our redirect and that's going to our affiliate offer. And if they've already subscribed, this is going to our affiliate offer. So that's perfect. That's all done. It's collecting an email address. So we're basically done. That's how easy it is to integrate. Now, why do we want to integrate a form? Because we could also do, we could also do an integration like this. We could select Aweber and this is going to be an API. So we're going to add to a list with a tag and we'll select a list, right? I've got a lot of lists in my Aweber, uh, APP2. And then we could do a tag like, you know, demo list. And we could basically just do that. The problem with this is in Aweber, let me show you, let's go over to Aweber. In the list options, you want to go to list settings, the confirmation message. If you have an Aweber account, you can't turn this off. That will be set and you can't turn it off. And that's how I just set up that ClickFunnels. So, but this one, send confirmation for Aweber signup forms, that one you can turn off. So when you go back to ClickFunnels, you remove this integration and you go and you select that HTML form, integrate an existing form and paste it in there. Say web form, email, save. Now, just check that it's in there. Yep. So now Aweber sees this, sees this form as basically an Aweber form because we are using an Aweber form. So they know that all the, the proper stuff is in there. So that way we can turn this off. So this is really important because you don't want that double opt-in because a lot of times what happens, people opt in to the product, they get sent to the page. But the problem is, they don't they don't get added to your list it'll just say pending because they have to go to their email and they have to click on confirm that they want to join your list a lot of times that confirm message ends up in spam or junk so people never see it so you could you could lose half of the signups because they're not confirming to being on your list so this way you get to turn that off and that's basically it now you you just have to go drive people to your to your landing page, right? So you save it, and it's basically you. Of course, you want to test it, hit preview. This is great. So what this is, this is just a little GIF that recaptures it. And notice it puts the check mark in itself. So enter your best valid email to confirm your system. Boom, you click that and click to continue, and it should take me to. Oh look at because I'm already on my own list. Oh, it can't be tight. It can't be reached. Interesting. Look at that, guys. There's a typo right there. See, isn't this good that you checked it? And there it is. So see what I'm, see what I'm saying? So this is why you really want to check it. So... 
let's copy this link. Let's go back to AWeber, our list settings. Let's go back to our pages and forms, sign up forms, demo. We're going to edit it. We want to go to next step and we want to fix this. Oh, I can see right there. So this this guy's right here is where it was. So we can still run it through. You can do it either way. I'm going to run it through the digistore.com. Um, so now, save form. Go to step three. Again, I will install my form, raw HTML. Turn off the pretty stuff. Right, select the form. So we click on there. Hit shift and we copy, go over to click funnels, go to integrations and we want to replace this. Now we want to double check that that link got replaced. So I didn't even notice it when I was checking it and it's so easy to see, but see now it is correct. So we want to save, resync the email and save. Now this will take a few minutes to uh, go live. So we want to, we just want to save it again. Hopefully it pushes out the live version. Check the integration. Yep. That link looks good. And preview. Let's see if it takes us to the right place now. There you go, guys. So that was it. That was see. That's how. That's why you always want to test your your list, your your opt-in pages. All right. If you have any questions, if you're on YouTube, drop them below. If you want to join my university, message me, and I'll show you how you can get into it. It's currently ninety seven dollars a month. Now there is some offers. If you buy like Cheetah Method, you can get a there's an upsell in there that you get a really big discount for. Also, if you join me in AI Cash Machines, which is my coach's program, you are able to, basically, if you join join AI Cash Machines, which is the link, the link will be below as well, you're able to get into my school totally free, lifetime access, as long as you're in the AI Cash Machines program with my coach. Little big, well, actually, it's a big bonus. And saving you a thousand dollars, and you get you get to ask me questions directly there. You can share with me all that kind of stuff. So that's it, guys. Again, if you're on YouTube, make sure you hit the subscribe button. If you're in the university, drop questions for me. If you need help, if you've got products, if you've got a, a funnel that's not working correctly, just let me know. If you have any other things you're struggling with, just drop me a question. I'll make a video about it. We can chat about it. All that kind of stuff. All right, guys. I will see you on the next one.